it's time for another Nerd Block unboxing video. This time, March's block has arrived very quickly as well. So, I have no idea what's inside this month, so we're just going to open it up. And I'm going to have a look, and I'm going to pull out the first item I see, or, or feel. And I think it's going to be the t-shirt, because that's what's in my hand, so have a look. Ooh, it's Shaun of the Dead. Awesome. So it says, a slice of fried gold. He's got a beer in his hand. This is really cool. So this month's box theme is Simon Pegg themed, as we can already see from the t-shirt, with Simon Pegg on the t-shirt. So it'll be items to do with Simon Pegg or items Simon Pegg has picked out. So I'm really, really excited about this theme. So hopefully this is good, as good as that. So let's see what else we have. Um, ooh, I don't know what to pick. I'm going to take this. Ah, okay. So they said there was going to be a money figure in there and I got one in my loot crate last month and I didn't I thought they were going to be the same one but this is actually a smaller one so that's good two different ones so let's open this up see what's inside if we can get it open oh it's a blind bag okay so it comes in different colors as you can see there uh I really like the purple one I think and oh does it have oh it's got some stickers as well you can put on it Oh, little cat ones are really cute, and the little things are cute as well, so I might use those. Okay, so let's see what we got. Oh, I've got yellow. And it's got a little paint bucket as well. Look how cute that is. So I've got a little yellow one, and it actually looks like a cat. I quite like it, actually. Quite sweet, so. And we've got the stickers we can add to it, including, like, a little mouse for its pocket and a hello thing like Shaun of the Dead so that's really quite cool so that's quite sweet I actually like that bigger than um, better than the bigger one I got in my loot crate which I haven't even opened yet so this is awesome I like that a lot it's quite sweet so I'm using that and this is a trink a trinkly what color did you get probably pronouncing that wrong let's put that down there and what else do we got? Okay, what is this? Ooh, Guardians of the Galaxy. Uh, it looks like it's a Star Lord magnet. I, I love Guardians of the Galaxy. Really, really enjoyed the movie. Um, started to get into the comics as well, especially the Star Lord ones and the one for Ra um, Rocket Raccoon. So I really like that, and that will go on my fridge. Awesome. I probably would have liked um, Rocket Raccoon more, but Star Lord's also good. So we've got a book as well. I can feel a book. Oh, yes! Yes, this is awesome. This is the best thing you could have got for Simon Pegg. And my box is falling because it's now not weighted. Okay. Simon Pegg's Nerd Duel. This is what I really hoped was going to be in there. If it was a Simon Pegg box, I was hoping his book would be in there. Um, so as far as I know, this is his autobiography. And I have seen this in the library I work in before, and it just looks awesome. So it's all about him being a nerd, really. And so it's perfect for a nerd block. So I'm really happy with that, and I will definitely read that. So that's very exciting. And I'm really glad nerd blocks decided to include books every month now, because I, I love books. I work in a library, so and I write books as well. So I really, really like that they're going to include books every month gives me something new to read. So let's see what else we have. Ooh, this is Guardians of the Galaxy as well. So this must be the exclusive Groot item. Oh yes, I see there's a dancing baby Groot at the bottom. So this is a Guardians of the Galaxy Russian nesting egg with all the characters. So let's see if we can open this up. This is quite cool. I've never seen one of these before, so this is new. So we've got Big Groot to start with. And then we've got, I think his name is Drax. Drax is next. I'm going to make such a mess here. And then we have Star-Lord. And then we 
F. Um, Gormia, Gormaya? I can't remember how to say her name. Oh, and then we have Rocket. Rocket Raccoon. And then the last one is a teeny, teeny little baby Groot. Aww. Opens up as well, so he can hide something inside of him. Look how tiny. <laughs> so he fits inside of Rocket. I quite like the Rocket one as well, even though he looks a bit vicious there. Yeah, that is really, really awesome. And now I'm not going to be able to put it back together because I can't remember which sides go with it. Amora. Oops. Amora. Okay, I'll do this later. <laughs> but that's going to be a mess. Clean up the door. Okay, so what do we got next? I don't think we have much left. I don't feel much left. So there's a little card. <gasps> oh. So, I already know the theme for the next nerd block is the 80s, which I'm really, really excited about because I love lots of 80s stuff, Back to the Future and Ghostbusters, and it looks like we're going to have some kind of Ghostbusters thing. It says, Ghostbusters, I ain't afraid of no spoilers. Um, you have a dose of freaky ghosts you better call nerd block. We've teamed up with Titan Merchandise and Sony Pictures to bring you subscribers an epic Officially licensed vinyl Ghostbusters collectible. Yay! Um, oh, I'm really excited about that. Ghostbuster collectible. I can only hope for a Back to the Future item as well. Maybe a t-shirt. That would be awesome. So, what else have we got? There is something else. Oh, there is another card. Let's look at that first. I'm going to avoid looking at the last item. I'm probably going to get spoiled if I look at the card enough. So what is the last item? Okay. <laughs> this is a bit random. So it says it is Mr. J's April Fool's kit. Um, for those that don't know who Mr. J is, that is the Joker. That's uh, Mr. J is what Harley Quinn, the character from Batman, the animated series, um, calls the Joker. So Mr. J's April Fool kit, and what we have in here is a couple different Batman characters. So we've got Mr. Freeze, um, Ice Ice Babies, and they're little spiders in ice cubes. <laughs> this is really random. I'm going to open this up. <laughs> it's quite amusing, but so, so random. So we've got, this is our practical joke kit for April Fools, it seems. So. We've got these little spiders in ice to scare someone by putting them in their drink. I may be frozen, but my jokes are red hot. Um, if anybody knows me, then they know I love the Nostalgia Critic review about Batman and Robin. Because there are such cheesy jokes by Arnold Schwarzenegger as Mr. Freeze. If you haven't had a chance to watch it, please watch Batman and Robin's review on Nostalgia Critic. It's brilliant. And then the other thing is actually a whoopee cushion with Harley Quinn on it. And I love Harley Quinn. She is one of my favorite characters from Batman. And it says, it's got a picture of Harley and it says, drop the bomb. I've never actually had a whoopee cushion in my life, so apparently now I own one. So... That seems to be everything in the box. So the Joker's kit consisted of two things. <laughs> and the box is now empty. Mm. So in the next few days, I should have a couple other boxes coming. Um, I won't tell you what they are, but you'll see when they come and we'll unpack, unpack those as well. So thank you for watching and hopefully you enjoyed watching this unboxing video and there was some interesting stuff on it, lots of good stuff this month. So I'm really happy with everything. I think the book is really my favorite. I really have wanted to read this book and haven't got around to it yet. It's when I always look at the library and don't take out. So this is the thing I'm looking forward to the most. So really good box, really enjoyed it. Glad I've subscribed to Nerdblock still and staying with it for at the moment. So thanks again for watching and goodbye.